always design products for people. And the, uh, you know, whether I wear, that I wear now, or cars or, or uh, any kind of a products, including furniture. Uh, I always think about people who uh, use those items and the, uh, you know, try to use my imagination to become that person. Same process, same thing, same philosophy, it's the same thing. The biggest difference between art and the design, in my view, is art is something that you use your own money and please yourself to discover your own, uh, you know, uh, art piece. But a design is something that you use somebody else's money, your client's money, to make a business out of that, you know, um, so that uh, you have to be able to understand who uses it at the end. But in the process, you need to understand what your client in front of you wants with this funding that uh, is, you know, loaning to you, basically. So design is not really you involved first. Maybe at the end, you discover who's going to use it. But it's almost like a cooking that you, at the end, add a little salt and pepper. That's me. So Ken Okoyama doesn't come at first, but it comes at the very end to add a little bit of the personal touch to it. But that's all. In my view, there is no globalization in terms of point of view from customer's aspect. But there is definitely globalization from a manufacturer's aspect. To make the same product for Germany, uh, Japan, or US, of course, makes it more comfortable. But there is no way that you can sacrifice the convenience of people. When you really think about local people, if it happens to be the same product that resolves the same problem, as, let's say, German people. Yeah, maybe you can have the same product, but if local people want something different, you should definitely make something different. I was on the recipient side before of a Red Dot Design Award when I worked in Italy uh, or US, but now I'm a uh, giving part. I think what's great about Red Dot Design Award is that it's not just choosing products or you know whatever that is made by people but I think letting people know and involving people to have a beautiful uh, ceremony and also the process is very open to public so that uh, people understand what the design is all about and actually you can buy those products and you can use them you can appreciate it and you can look forward to who's going to receive the next year's Red Dot Design Award. This is a really evolving process and I really like about this award. That is good for public to find out what design is all about. Still my, you know, this phase of my career, I enjoy very much of uh, applying for award like Red Dot Design Award and also receiving them. <laughs> and also letting people know that we receive them because people really admire it. They look at you in a different way and they like the change. And I'm sure the younger people who just started a career or just you know, uh, came to a certain period of changing maybe the career to a different uh, aspect, it is a good chance to try something different and letting people know what you can do with all the opportunities and the great challenges. I think it's a great award.